Hello everyone, welcome back to Sawdust and Circuits. Today we're diving into a project that's equal parts useful, fun, and potentially dangerous if you're not careful. Yep, we're building a 3D printed brushless test stand. The servo tester needs to be broken down a bit. The outer shell just peels off, but this knob was very hard to remove. And then when I finally got it off, it shot all the way across the office, and I had to pause the video and go find it. First things first, let's mount this little speed demon. We'll secure the motor to the 3D printed stand using M3 by 0.5 millimeter screws. Make sure everything is snug, but not Hulk tight. We don't want to strip anything. Now we need to mount the motor bracket onto our trusty wood plank with some good old number 10 wood screws. This will keep the motor from achieving independent flight. Now it's time for some light surgery. We're soldering a 5.5 millimeter power jack onto the electronic speed control because plugging things in is much easier than chasing down loose wires. Time to close this thing up, like a high-tech sandwich. For this I'm using M2 coarse thread screws, two per side, to keep everything nice and secure.
Now let's attach this beauty to the back side of the plank for balance. Unless you want to be chasing a runaway motor. Now this setup is great, but we could definitely make it better. I'm thinking an RPM sensor, or maybe even a cool upgrade so that we could measure the thrust that is generated by this motor. Time to plug this all in and see if it works. And there you have it, a do-it-yourself 3D printed brushless motor stand. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below about what upgrades you would like to see in this build. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.